Once we've determined that you do have cataracts and that you are having symptoms that are affecting your daily life, we'll talk more about different options for you. Those options include our Catalyst Femtosecond Laser System, a really exciting approach to cataract surgery. Laser cataract assisted surgery has added to the precision and accuracy of the procedure. It allows us to adjust for astigmatism. It's really changed the way that we perform surgery. If I were to have cataract surgery personally, I would choose the laser. When it came time for my father to have cataract surgery, we chose the laser for him. I think if you were to ask any of our surgeons today, the majority of them would choose the Catalyst femtosecond laser for their surgery. There are several options uh, that we have for cataract surgery and lens implantation. So when we're taking out a cataract, we always put a lens in. Different than years ago, where surgery was at its new frontier, we remove cataracts without implanting a lens. And those are the patients that you might have seen years ago who had these Coke bottle type lenses in order for them to see. Where if they took those Coke bottle lenses off, they had very limited vision. So today, the options that we'll be discussing in the exam room are options related to the type of lens that we can put in your eye. So it really breaks down to three to four choices. Uh, the first choice is a choice where we use an extended depth of field lens that allows you to see at all distances most of the time. So it allows you to see far, computer, and near. And we'll talk a little bit more about the specifics of that lens. But ultimately, that lens choice is for people who want to be mostly out of glasses. Another lens choice is the toric intraocular lens. And that lens is for astigmatism. That lens is for people who have an astigmatism correction in their eye. And so after removing the cataract, we're actually still treating the astigmatism that they have on the front surface of the eye called the cornea. And so by choosing this lens, it allows patients to be less dependent on glasses after surgery. Another lens option is a monofocal lens implant. This is a lens that has been used for years in the field of eye surgery. It allows patients to see at one focal point, meaning that it allows a patient to see either at distance or near. Another approach is blended monovision. Blended monovision is where we make one eye for far and one eye for near. Many of you may have had experience doing this with contact lenses in the past. Blended monovision allows a patient to sync both eyes together so as to allow them to be able to go without glasses. Let's talk a little bit about what you can expect with your surgery. Here at the Surgery Center, you'll meet our board-certified anesthesiologist who will be directly involved with your care. We'll then bring you into the operating room where we will perform your procedure. You'll be sedated during that procedure. The procedure will be painless. It will last approximately 10 to 20 minutes. After the procedure, you'll go into the post-operative area where you'll get a nice drink, relax, and go home in approximately five to 10 minutes. You'll be able to go back to most of your normal activities by that evening. Many of my patients go out to dinner that evening. The next day, you'll come into our office for your post-operative examination. where We'll look into your eyes, test your vision, and you'll start your new journey with better vision.